What's up, YouTube world? It's your boy, More Masters, coming back at y'all with another one. Before I start this video, I ask you to please smash the like, comments, and share, and become a member of my channel. I want to talk about these pit bulls, man, people say they have. Um, this is where it all started from, man. Uh, John P. Colby and Earl Turner, if I hope I said his name right, uh, 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 William Leitner, those guys, man. This is like in the 1800s. You know, everything isn't what it is. This is Pincher. Pincher wasn't an American pit bull terrier. He was crossed with bulldog and staff. Colby had a lot of cross dogs as well. So this goes to show y'all that they've been doing this in the 1800s. This is a, 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 a Staffordshire Terrier right here. This isn't an American pit bull terrier. They got that from them bulldogs and those old Southern whites. And that bull and terrier, that's where that white stuff come from, man. You see this? This is way back in the day. You know, um, I like to say shout out to the masters of all bulldogs because, you know, he know what he's talking about. A lot of people might not agree with what he's talking about, but those are the dogs right there that made this breed right here. This is how the pit bull terrier came, you know what I mean, from those staffs, those bulldogs, and some other terrier that nobody know. With, with made these dogs. By the way, this is that tombstone bloodline. But once again, what I was saying, shout out to you, Master Vault Bulldogs. It's your boy, more Master. I prove this now.